space science has grown increasingly concerned about planetary defense. That's an area of research, technology and innovation aimed at defending our planet against threats such as asteroids. If a seriously big asteroid were to hit Earth, again, remember the dinosaurs, it would wipe out a city or two, potentially cause devastating tsunamis and or a massive dust cloud that could smother the planet, inhibit sun rays and block our access to light and life itself. At least that's what some scientists say led to the extinction of the dinosaurs. The sunlight got blocked, vegetation failed to grow and the dinosaurs starved to death. The newly discovered asteroid 2023 DW is currently the only object scientists are tracking that registers on the Torino scale, which is used by science communicators to gauge how much of a public concern a particular space object is. A 1 on the Torino scale essentially means that this is an object that wants more observation, and there's a very good chance those additional observations will provide more data about 2023 DW's orbit that allows astronomers to rule out or significantly decrease the odds of an actual impact. Newly found asteroids are frequently popping up at or near the top of the risk list, only to fall far down its ranks days or weeks later when additional observations come in. If that unlikely event comes to pass, it's important to note that the object is currently estimated at about 50 meters in diameter. That's comparable to the two most powerful asteroid impacts of modern times, both took place over Russia in 1908 and 2013 and did significant but largely superficial damage. The 1908 Tunguska event flattened a massive section of remote Siberian forest, while the 2013 bolide impacted the atmosphere at a less steep angle that effectively reduced its potential force. Thousands of windows were blown out in the major city of Chelyabinsk and some buildings were damaged with numerous minor injuries reported but no deaths. Asteroid 2023 DW currently tops the European Space Agency's risk list for near-Earth objects with about a 1 in 625 chance of colliding with our planet on Valentine's Day, February 14, 2046. If 2023 DW were to strike a direct hit on a metro area, it could do some pretty serious damage. This is, of course, statistically pretty unlikely since most of Earth is covered by ocean or wilderness. Pulling down a large asteroid by blasting it with a weapon could lead to hundreds of smaller fragments that could collide with Earth or other rocky objects. To avoid this, alternate strategies include using gravitational force to pull the asteroid out of its orbit. This would require a massive object like a space capsule or satellite to get close to the asteroid and change its course. Also planetary defense technology, such as NASA's DART mission, aims to track asteroids and, if they ever become a direct threat to life on Earth, to nudge them into a different orbit, the problem is that scientists have yet to detect every asteroid out there. What is your opinion on the threat of asteroids? Are you worried? Or do you trust that scientists will find a solution in case of an emergency? Please share your thoughts on this topic in the comments below, and keep watching for more. We'll be back soon with more updates on Space Bites.